Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are doing our Baxi Charm unboxing. And it is April, April, yeah. Um, this month's theme is Peace, Love, and Boxy, cute. Um, and I just peeked at the card, like always, to see what was um, in the box so I knew what I could have on my face. So I do have like my foundation and concealer and just a little bit of bronzer, brows, all done. Because we're going to do the rest of the face by what's in the box. So you ready to see what's in there? Okay. Let's see. First, what do I want to do? Let's do... So first, there's a brush set. So this is from Luxie. And it is the Summer Days days with a Z um, three piece brush set um, it says the Luxie Shimmer Days three piece brush set was curated for the perfect festival look that will last all day use the Luxie 512 small contouring brush to sculpt and define your cheekbones while the Luxie 245 small shader brush is perfect to pat on your base shadow and glitter, grab the Luxie 209 large shader brush to pat on and blend out any eye look. And these are 28 bucks for the three. So that's your contour brush, just a flat eyeshadow, and then like a kind of flat shader brush. So I'm excited to try those. I love Luxie brushes. Okay, next in the box we have the Pure festival what's this called just the pure festival palette look at that packaging isn't that cute so this is kind of like a festival themed box Ugh, if i can get into this is the question how about let's read about it while i'm trying to open it, it says unleash the ultimate festival vibes with this limited edition 12 piece pressed pigment palette that's Complete with bold, imaginative pigments that elevate your look for any occasion. From boho-inspired metallics to eye-catching glitters, each cruelty-free shade is infused with skin-loving ingredients. And this palette is $36. What's in here? Kitty grip. Oh, comes with a sample of eyeshadow primer. Cool. And... Ooh. This is what the eyeshadows look like. So there's some super glittery ones here. And then some metallics and mattes. It looks like kind of a mix of everything. So yeah, let's do a quick little eye look with this and see what we come up with. I'm probably not going to do anything crazy because I'm supposed to actually go out in public after this. So... Probably won't use the glitters, but I'll swatch them for you. Okay, so let me just get, I'm sorry, all of my brushes are dirty. I need to clean them, so don't judge me, okay? All right, first I'm going to take the shade Epic, which is this nice warm brown here. And we'll use that as a transition color. Let's see how that goes. It's a nice warm brown, a little orangey. Oh, that's so much brighter than I thought it was gonna be, but that's okay. So next, I'm going to take this brush that came in the kit. This is the Luxie 209 Large Shader. And I'm going to go into the color right here, which is called Hidden Desert. And it's like a warm, medium, kind of reddish brown. And I'm going to pop that on the outer corner and into the crease. Mm 
Okay, so that's pretty. I'm gonna blend that out with this first brush I used. I think I went a little higher on that eye with the red. Okay, and then I'm going to shake, take the shade All Night, which is the dark brown, and I'm going to take that on a pencil brush. This one looks very pigmented, and just put that right on the outer, very outer V, right out there. Helps if you guys can see what I'm doing, right? Darken up that corner a little bit. Okay, and then just go back over it with that last brush. Make sure it's blended. And then, hmm, what color do I want to use on the lid? Well, I'm going to use this brush the Luxie 245 Small Shader Brush. And I think I'm going to dip into the shade Good Vibes right here. Just kind of a copper color. And let's put that on the lid. Okay, that's pretty. I am getting some fallout with this one, but that's all right. Okay, then I'm just gonna kinda go back through and make sure I didn't lose any of those other colors. Just like that. Okay, and then I'm going to go with my pencil brush in the darkest brown and run that underneath my waterline here. And I'm going to take the more red color. Blend that out a little. Okay, so I wiped off that flat shader brush and I'm taking the color Free Spirit, which is the lightest shimmery shade here. And I'm just gonna take a little bit of that and pop it in the inner corner. This color doesn't really have a lot of oomph to it. Okay, so next thing in the box is this, this, and it is the Starlux Ultra Gem Longwear Eye Pencil. 
says the intensely pigmented formula in your new Starlux Cosmic Ultra Gem Longwear Eye Pencil delivers a beautiful color that lasts all day. The easy to extend and retract pen makes application and continuous use seamlessly easy without ever having to use a pencil sharpener. And this is $19. So let's see what this eye pencil looks like. Oh, I was expecting black. That's like green. Okay, well, let's just put some on the waterline, see what it looks like. It's not really showing up. Let's warm it up a little bit. That did absolutely nothing. Yeah, that did nothing. And it's like, let's see if I can, can you see the bag of my, like that's how pale it is. It's like a nice shimmery green, but that's not showing up. So that's what I think about that one. Let's see, what's next in the box? Next is the Butter, Butter. Butter London Power Up Mascara. And this is experience length, definition, and curl retention with Butter London's Power Up Mascara featuring all day wear with the first swipe, a unique oil-free blend of nourishing waxes instantly produces noticeably longer and more defined lashes. A second swipe adds thickness and volume without clumping. Soft and creamy formula is infused with hydrating jojoba extract and water resistant polymers to reduce smudging and flaking for a full eight hour day. And this retails for $20. So here it is. It's a big old honking thing. So let's put some of this on. Ooh, it's got a weird, weird wand. Okay. These type of wands scare me because I have a tendency to stab myself in the eye with them and they hurt so bad. Okay, that's one coat. Looks pretty good. Let's try two. Okay, so that actually looks pretty good. I like that. I'm going to keep playing with it and try it because it's pretty. I like it. Okay, so last thing in the box is this which is the Artist Couture Diamond Glow Powder. It says this all natural, vegan, and cruelty-free loose powder highlight can be used on the eyes, lips, face, and body. The versatile formula is highly pigmented and suitable for all skin tones. Create a subtle, luminous finish or layer for an unreal glow. And this is $27. So let's see what it looks like. It's in the shade Summer Haze. It looks a little dark for me, but okay, I'm back. That seriously took me forever to try and get into. So yeah, I got it open. Now let's see what this crap looks like. 
Okay, let's get my little highlighting brush. Where is it? Right here. And let's just dip into that lightly. Because this scares me. Okay, we ready? Okay. Okay, that's not very scary. It's actually really pretty. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah, that's pretty. pajama pants but yeah so all in all I think this was a really good box um I love the eyeshadow palette the highlighters okay pretty the mascara seems pretty good I like the brushes the only thing that sucks is this eyeliner but I don't know I'll play with it see if I can make it work but yeah that was it for this month's BoxyCharm unboxing um, I hope you guys enjoy these as much as I do. So please give me a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and if you are not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!